Lenny Andrade. Lenny de Andrade Lima, January 25, 1943 to July 24, 2023, known professionally as Lenny Andrade, was a Brazilian singer and musician. Both Andrade's first and last names are sometimes misspelled in English as Len, Lenny, and Andrade. She had several hits on the Brazilian charts. In 2007, she shared a Latin Grammy Award with Cesar Camargo Mariano for Best MPB, Musica Popular Brasileira, Album, Ao Vivo. Andrade performed with Paquito de Rivera, Luiz ECA, Dick Farney, Joao Donato, Yumir Deodato, Perry Ribeiro, and Francis Heim. Andrade's style is a synthesis of samba and jazz. Lenny de Andrade Lima was born in Rio de Janeiro on January 25, 1943. Andrade began her career singing in clubs, lived five years in Mexico, and spent a good part of her life living in the United States and Europe. She studied piano at the Brazilian Conservatory of Music. Lenny Andrade died on July 24, 2023, at the age of 80. Doris Montero Adelina Doris Montero, October 23, 1934 to July 24, 2023, was a Brazilian singer and actress. She was discovered in 1949 on the radio show Papal Carbono with Renato Merce, broadcast on national radio in Rio de Janeiro. In 1951, as a student in Colegio Dom Pedro II, she was invited to sing on Radio Guanabara. She later went on to Radio Tupi, where she stayed for eight years. She sang at the Copacabana Palace Hotel nightclub and made her recording debut with Say Voce Say Importus, If You'd Cared, which was released on a 78 RPM disc. In 1952, she was elected Queen of Cadets and recorded Fecho Meus Aljas, I Close My Eyes, by Jose Maria de Abreu. Her first long play was released in 1954 it included Vento Soprando, Wind Blowing, by Continental Records, featuring Gracchus Adeus, Thank God, Fernando Cesar, and Joga Reed No Mar, Throw the Net to the Water, Fernando Cesar Nazareno de Brito. In 1955, she hosted her own TV show at the TV Tupi in Rio de Janeiro. In 1956, she released Moceno Benito, Pretty Guy, by Billy Blanco, one of her greatest hits. Doris Montero was born in Rio de Janeiro on October 23, 1934. She died on July 24, 2023, at the age of 88. No cause of death was given recently. George Alajaya George Maxwell Alajaya OBE, November 22, 1955 to July 24, 2023, was a Ceylonese-born British newsreader, journalist, and television presenter. From 2007 until 2022, he was the presenter of the BBC News at 6 and was previously the main presenter of GMT on BBC World News from its launch in 2010 until 2014. He was appointed officer of the Order of the British Empire, OBE, in the 2008 New Year Honours. Alajaya joined the BBC in 1989 after seven years in print journalism with South Magazine. Before becoming a presenter, he was developing World Correspondent, based in London, and then Southern Africa Correspondent in Johannesburg. As one of the BBC's leading foreign correspondents, he reported on events ranging from the genocide in Rwanda to the plight of the Marsh Arabs in southern Iraq to the civil wars in Afghanistan, Liberia, Sierra Leone, and Somalia. In June 2020, Alajaya said that cancer had spread to his lungs, liver, and lymph nodes, but was not at a chronic or terminal stage. In October 2022, Alajaya announced that his cancer had spread further and he took a break from television to undergo a new series of treatment. Alajaya died from the illness on July 24, 2023, at the age of 67. Pamela Blair, December 5, 1949 to July 23, 2023, 
was an American actress, singer, and dancer best known for originating the role of Val in the musical A Chorus Line and several appearances on American soap operas. Blair made several appearances on American soap operas such as Loving, Another World, Brian's Hope, and All My Children, for which she received a Daytime Emmy nomination. She guest starred on such shows as Law and Order, The Cosby Show, The Days and Nights of Molly Dodd, and Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Blair guest starred in a movie of the week titled Man Eater for Lifetime. She appeared opposite Jodie Foster in the TV films Vengali and in feature films Mighty Aphrodite directed by Woody Allen, 21 Grams with Sean Penn and Benicio Del Toro, before and after with Meryl Streep and Liam Neeson and Annie as the maidenette. Blair married actor and film director Don Scardino in 1984, and they divorced in 1991. She lived in northern New Jersey for a time, and last resided in Arizona where she owned her own therapeutic and myofacial massage studio for athletes. Blair died in Phoenix in July 23, 2023, at the age of 73. No cause of death was given recently. Vince Hill Vincent Hill, April 16, 1934 to July 21, 2023, was an English traditional pop music singer, best known for his cover version of the Rodgers and Hammerstein show Tune Edelweiss, 1967, which reached number two on the UK singles chart, staying on the chart for 17 weeks. He recorded 25 studio albums and several soundtracks, wrote songs and plays and hosted TV shows during the 1970s and 1980s, including They Sold a Million, BBC, Musical Time Machine, BBC, and his own chat show Gas Street, ITV. Outside of his work in show business, he was a patron of the Macular Society, a UK charity for anyone affected by central vision loss. In December 2019, it was reported that Hill was to play Baron Hardup in Cinderella 2, The Mrs. Charming Years, at the Kenton Theatre in Henley on Thames. Hill became a patron of the Macular Society in October 2010. Hill suffered from AMD from 2011. This was a major reason for his reluctantly retiring from live performances. In support of the society, Hill donated all proceeds from sales of his legacy greatest hit CD to the society to help beat macular disease. Hill also released a limited edition 2021 charity calendar, with proceeds going to the Macular Society. In August 2021, it was revealed via Twitter that Hill had recently suffered a stroke. Vince Hill died at home in Henley-on-Thames on July 21, 2023, at the age of 89.